Hey you guys, so before I get started with this video, I just wanted to give a quick update with how the GoFundMe campaign is currently doing. For those of you who are not sure what I'm talking about, make sure to check out the video, which will be up here linked at the top. So this GoFundMe page is basically going to any Navajo families on the reservation who may need assistance during this COVID-19 pandemic. So as of today, the campaign has been up for six days and so far there are $2,600 currently raised. So I just wanna say thank you so much to everybody who donated and shared if you have not donated feel free to donate like even if it's just five dollars two dollars twenty dollars like however much you can i know we're all going through this and yeah i just want to say thank you so much to everybody for sharing and donating all right you guys enjoy this vlog Cheers. Good morning guys. Welcome to today's video. Today is Monday and I decided to vlog all week basically. Um, for those of you who are new, my name is Sierra and welcome to the video. Let me show you guys these beautiful delicious scones. This one is a blue corn apricot pine nut scone. This one, I kind of ate it. <laughs> This one is a blue corn, blueberry, lemon scone. Super delicious. I did have six in here. I gave two to my friend and I ate the other two and now I have two left. Super good. If you guys want to place an order with her, she is located within the valley area and does deliver. So I'll put the contact information below. All right, you guys, as you can see, I am still working from home. I have my scone here, my coffee, and this is my workstation. But yeah, currently work from home vibes. I am definitely enjoying this a little too much. It is now about 12.30. It's actually my lunch. What am I doing? It's my lunch time, but I'm still working. So maybe I'll take lunch and show you guys an update on my little garden over there. Seriously, these scones are delicious. I highly recommend if you're in the Phoenix area, place and order. Information will all be down below. So good. Here's a little garden update. Um, they're growing pretty good. I don't know if something is eating this or what. But as you can see, the leaves are kind of scraggly looking. This one obviously is dying. I don't, I think it was too hot. It used to be right there, but I moved it over here. So hopefully that's better. No squash yet on these, still waiting. And then here is my watermelon plant, which no melons as far as I can see. But it's growing beautifully. Look how look how huge it's getting. Super huge. We have friends playing in the background. And I also need to update you guys on this. As you can see, I updated the whole thing because I got some new plants and I was like, you know what? I know I'm gonna want more plants, so I'm gonna need more room, but isn't it beautiful? I ordered the shelves off of Walmart online and they came in like two days. So pretty fast delivery from them. But this is one of the new ones I got. So pretty, as well as this one. Look at these leaves. How beautiful are these leaves? But this one, there's also a new leaf coming in, which has been taking forever. But you guys, I am so, happy about my little plant corner i just love it and obviously buster loves it too because he hangs out right here all the time buster buster you want to say hi to the vlog he's being a little shy for those of you who are new that's buster yeah so it's looking beautiful super beautiful and green i love it so this is the before as you can see it is overcrowded with plants so i definitely need a bigger shelf are you ready for your walk to go outside it's about let me see what time is it you guys 
it's about 8.03 right now. If this will focus on my watch, which it's not. It's about 8 o'clock. Just got done working. But this boy knows it's ready to time to go outside. So that's what we're going to do. Right? But yeah, he waits at the door for his little leash thing. He knows what time it is. Look how excited he gets. Uh, we're going to take you on the walk. Some people have asked, why don't you take Buster on a walk? You don't take Buster anywhere. Yes, we do. We just don't vlog it, huh, Buster? Right? Yep. Anyways, we'll be right back. Yep. So here we are on our walk, Buster and I. We typically walk about a mile and a half to two miles, depending on how hot it is and how hot Buster gets. Uh, tonight, it's actually 99 degrees, which isn't too bad because sometimes we walk when it's like 102 or 104, but I think he'll be fine. I also bring him water, so he's good. I'll show you guys when he drinks out of the water bottle. It's super cute, and sometimes when the sprinklers are going, we'll play in the sprinklers. Sprinklers. <laughs> sprinklers. So you guys stay tuned for that. Come on, Buster. He loves this walk, I swear. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. Alrighty, this is where we usually get water. You ready? Drink the whole thing. Uh oh. I usually like to give them water here at the bus stop because there's a trash can right here. And now we're on our way home. Come on. All right, the sprinkler is on. Go, Buster, go. At least it cools him down a little. Now he's doing his business. We'll be right back. All right, you guys, I just got out of the shower. So I'm about to cook some dinner. Uh, I think I'm gonna make some mashed potatoes and pork chops, possibly. I don't know. Stay tuned. dinner it's actually i think it's beef this is actually beef so there you have it it looks delicious i'm super excited Hey guys today is tuesday as you saw i just made breakfast now 3 p.m so just made breakfast that was 10 hours i know i forgot i just i just showed them on the vlog <laughs> just said jeff out here critiquing my vlogging you guys this just was hilarious what you just said <laughs> but i'm eating my last scone i'm kind of sad i'm gonna have to put in another order for this drinking it with this delicious tea that i found um yeah it's pretty good try it it's actually made here in Tempe, so try it if you haven't, it's pretty cool. I'm just here eating my scone, and I will see you guys once I get off work at 5 p.m. You've been off work, bro. I am doing new work orientation. New <laughs> Look at Jeff. Jeff. That Jeff is trying to be me vlogging. Do I do that? Yeah. <laughs> 
whatever. Totally forgot to vlog, but I just got back from grocery shopping. So now I have to wipe everything down, cook dinner. It's actually kind of late because I ended up taking like a two hour nap because Buster didn't wake me up. Maybe like a three hour nap, I don't know. Then I walk Buster and now here we are. It's about, what time is it? It is about, holy crap, it's 11 o'clock. <laughs> All right, so let me hear you and wipe everything down. You guys, when you go grocery shopping, make sure to wipe down and sanitize everything you bring into your home because you just never know. Um, and right now, apparently, Arizona is number one in coronavirus infections. So y'all need to be safe out there. Let me show you guys real quick what I just do. So I just kind of space everything out like that. And then I just spray it. So you just spray it like that and then I wipe it down. So that's all I do. That's all you need to do. It takes time but totally safe. Anyways, let me hurry up and finish doing this and then I'm gonna start cooking. All right, you guys, totally forgot to update you but I cooked dinner, just had some chicken drumsticks, side of butter pasta, salad, my soda and now we're watching a movie so I will see you guys tomorrow another day another breakfast for lunch so here we are it is currently Wednesday afternoon yes we do eat breakfast in the afternoon this is what we're having we got bacon scrambled eggs and waffles all right, there we have it. Breakfast, ain't nothing like a good old cup of OJ. Cheers, you guys. They had it a vlog? Yeah. Yep. All right, see you guys in a little bit. All right, you guys, just got back. Well, not just, but did my walk with Buster. And now I'm cooking. I feel like this is turning into a food vlog. So this might be like what Sierra cooks during the week. I don't know. But I'm excited. Tonight is taco night. Yay! Here it is. That's my human, humongous taco burrito. But it, it looks very delicious. Pretty simple, but super delicious. I'm excited. This is in the front yard. Say it's I did a vlog. You guys, it's a sad day. <gasps> I think it's safe to say RIP to my squash. I don't know if I can save this, but that one is dead. Um, I think I'm gonna pull that out. This one is okay. But look at my freaking watermelon. There's no melons growing yet, but She's out here thriving still. Hey everybody, welcome to mail time. Oh. How dare oh, there you. you. Hey guys, welcome to today's mail time stop. Jeff is trying to mess up my little recording session. And I got a couple packages. I was super excited when I saw my packages. Usually people message me and tell me that they sent me something. All right, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start with this Amazon one. Arteza waterproof, reusable, durable, movable, non-toxic chalkboard labels. Wow. Um, this is for me? Has my name on it. Thank you. <laughs> there's no, there's no return or anything about it. There's no letter in here. Chalkboard labels. Chalkboard labels? Everything drips. I'm confused. <laughs> Someone sent me chalk, chalkboard labels? Huh. All right, next one. Slip, but there's no info. Oh, this is the same thing. Liquid chalk markers. So I guess these go together. 
Wow, thank you. And then there's this box as well. Maybe these all go together. Oh, this is Julia. This is from Julia. Smooth infusion, slightly light, loosened curls. Hair products. So we have that. Styling foam mousse. Air control hairspray. Lip saver. Probably chapstick. This is really neat. Oh wow. It's all a box of hair products. So a lot of it. Uh, shampoo, conditioner, and stuff like that. Very cool, thank you, Julia. And then next we have this package. It's a chalkboard sticker. I'm assuming it's kind of like wallpaper? Huh, crazy. So all of these three go together. All these go together. Thank you so much, whoever sent these. I didn't get a letter with them, but thank you so much. I'm gonna figure out a project to do with that. Unless you have something in mind for me to do, um, message me or email me if you sent me these. Thank you so much. This is from Arlie in Chula Vesta, California. Saw this and immediately thought of you. Oh, I'm excited to see what it is. A note. Oh, I love cacti. Look at that. It's foil too. All right, she did write a letter in here. I'm gonna read it off camera, but she sent me San Diego sticker and a gift card. Thank you so much. I'm going to Starbucks after this. Well, that's it for mail time today. You guys, thank you so much for thinking of me and sending me something. And again, I do post all the things that I receive in the mail just so you guys don't wonder what or if I got your package. So you guys, if you do send me something, look forward to seeing it in a video. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time. Okay, bye.